Hi Taurus, how are you? Taurus Sun Moon Rising, welcome back. It's so good to be able to shuffle cards and connect with you right now. Now, of course, I have this video marked for October, but whew, the devil card. All right, Taurus, what's going on? Um, but if you are watching this from the future, that's fine too. Just allow yourself to be led by spirit, three of pentacles, and allow yourself to receive you know, these divine messages that, with divine timing. There's nothing wrong with that, Taurus. Okay. So, wow. A lot of justice cards been jumping out. Aries received the justice card as well a few times, and they also received two of pentacles. I'm not going to lie to you. So, Taurus, let me sit with this for a minute. Um, so, the devil card. Let me show you what I have here. First and foremost. So, the first card to jump out was the devil card. Second was the three of pentacles. Third was justice. And then fourth was two of pentacles. I'm going to sit with this for a minute. Um, Taurus. What I can hear and what I can sense right now is, oh my goodness. And I did not even see this until just now at the base of your reading is the four of swords and also aries received this same card what i can sense and what i can hear and what i can feel taurus is this word expectations um i just heard the word def defeating oh okay defying normal defying normalcy um i'm spirit is saying doing things different do things different, Taurus. Do things differently, Taurus. Um, okay, Taurus. Spirit is saying, drop the ball on them, Taurus. Let it go. Let that go, Taurus. It's not, you're doing too much. Okay, um, so Three of Pentacles is about collaboration. Spirit wants to talk to you about collabor collaborating. Collaborating. Who are you trying to connect with? Who are you trying to collab with? Be very mindful about this. Be very aware. Spirit is saying, be very aware. Listen to what it is. I'm hearing tick, 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 tick. They're telling you, their their spirit is speaking and saying tick, 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 tick. Meaning that it's only a matter of time before I reveal to you why this is not meant to work. It is for your highest and greatest good that you are removed from the situation, from the circumstance. It's, I don't know why, but it's the words that are coming through or what this is kind of giving me is um, parent, okay, this is weird, but parent-teacher conferences, uh, being on the board, um, uh, being like being on some type of board, being on some, some type of council, being on some type of radar, having this, wanting to be like organized, wanting to show up, wanting to get, get your hands dirty, wanting to be involved. Um, and spirit is just like, whatever it is that you're trying to get invested in and trying to commit yourself to, just be very okay with that not showing up in the way that you would want it to be. There's this Taurus, I don't know why, but spirit is kind of suggesting that um, these are not your people. This is not it for right now. There's this emphasis on right, right now. Tick, 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 tick. Give it time and you will see the boom. Um, we are going to... Okay, wow. So I heard we're going to move you away from malnourishment. Mouths need to be fed. Okay, wow. So Spirit is saying we are going to move you. And they, they they want to put in your hands, put in your grasp, put in your mouth, put in your belly, put in your home. What will actually nurture you, will actually nourish you, will actually support you. 
these are messages that is that I'm channeling. These are not just the cards. Of course, the cards that is that I'm looking at right now are the Devil card, the Justice card, Three of Pentacles, and Two of Pentacles. And at the root of your reading, you have Four of Swords. Um, I just feel, give it time and what you are trying to, what and who you're trying to build with will work itself out. They need to even iron out the kinks first before you show up in the next form, in the next way, in the next cycle, and in the next, um, I heard the word, I heard, it's like a promotion, like something that you want to promote yourself to, something that you're advocating for yourself to be promoted to. Um, I'm also, I don't know why, but I heard the word oblivion. Oh, oh, oblivious, oblivious. Okay, and as I said that, the candle popped. The higher wisdom candle, which is here on my left. I'm pretty sure it stocked in the apothecary because I've been working on them a lot lately for my clients. Um, it's you're oblivious to you're oblivious to this thing. You're oblivious to this problem. There's something that someone is sitting on in council, in a position of council, in a position of power. It's something that the community or the, the your work or your friends it's the this the the tribe i don't know what they allocate someone as a leader it's like how did she get to be the leader how are they you know it's just like why and it's almost like giving me like people pleasing vibes taurus i don't know um but this is what's coming through spirit is like just tick 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 let it oh my goodness yeah, this, I just feel like something is going to open up. A door is going to open up for you later. Don't get, don't get, dis, don't get defeated and discontent and frustrated with the fact that it's not opening up for you now. This is going to be an opportunity that's going to come for you later. Once this person gets pulled off of their, <laughs> gets pulled off of their throne. It's like Spirit is kind of laughing at whoever this is. He thinks that they're like in control. It's like this whole it's giving me very like not Stepford wives, but this whole like traditional student teacher parent thing where you know there there's this council or something and they all vote and it's like you got the cool moms. I don't know why this is coming through. Yeah, Eight of Swords. Something that's really been stressing you out. Something that's really been bothering you. Something that's plaguing you. Why? 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 Like I I want to. Why won't they let me get more involved? Why won't they let me be more hands-on? I'm I'm trying to, and it's just like, literally there's more to this than meets the eye. The judgment card just jumped out. There's some give it time and this thing, whatever this thing is, it's going to implode. You don't wanna be a part of that. When it implodes, there's going to be more opportunity to for you to show up i'm hearing show for show for show for show for show for spirit is going to literally like concierge kind of guide you into this opening of this realm this opening of this seat this opening of a position of power and you're actually going to have the four of cups at that point are you even going to want it at that point are you going to even want it um but for right now, I see you developing your skills. I see you developing your ideas. I see you feeling challenged. Is this in work relationships, I'm not. If this is, this is very. This is a very specific message for my Taurus people. But there's something about people pleasing. Okay, Eight of Pentacles. There's something about people pleasing and like who you know, helping you to get to where it is that you want to go. Helping you to get to where it is that you see yourself where you want to be. But Spirit is really a lot. Is telling you guys let let this kind of play out first there's some craziness that this wonkiness that's about to happen and we want you to develop yourself in the meantime until this seat wherever it is that you see yourself then opens up this doesn't necessarily have to be yeah queen of swords jumped out too wow a lot of repeating cards um, I just see you developing your, not maturity, but believing in yourself a little bit more, um, and holding yourself in a different way to, and then that's where you're going to gain a different outcome. I feel four, four months from now, four to eight months from now, depending, I just feel like it's going to be a total change of events for my Taurus people. 
a seat opens up, you, 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 there's like a vote or you, there's a deliberation, there's like a council. If this has to do with a relationship, there's, there's, is something either in your partner's career, in your partner's work or within your own work that give it time and a door is going to blast open and you're finally going to have a way out or a way in. If you're a single and this is a relationship type of thing, what I'm seeing is for my Taurus people, I feel that this is a um, partnership here that is something or you are freeing yourself from a situation. It's only a matter of time. You Four to eight months from now, you're, it's only a matter of time. The situation is going to implode or in the best way possible, trust me, and you're going to be in a different, a totally different position of power. Let's see what's going on with the Sacred Forest Oracle. Spirit is really trying to speak to this group, you guys. Look at this. New beginnings. Daffodil fairy. New beginnings. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Spirit is really... Oh my goodness. Look. Oh my goodness. I didn't even see this until just now. Uncertainty. And then also we have Storm Spirit Chaos. What you guys can't see is how much my root chakra, my spine, and my heart, like I have chills on the back of my neck. Spirit is really trying to speak to this, speak to this group. Um, it may not seem like a big deal to you, but it actually kind of is. In the eyes of spirit, it says it kind of is. I feel like you're being set, set up um for greater for better um so what what are you don't ignore spirit right now i also just heard a phone i'm hearing like a phone ringing keeping your mind out keep like keeping your an eye out or an ear open for a phone phone ringing text messages phone calls things that you hear just keeping an eye out for that because spirit is really trying to deliver a message to you. It's it's being while things are chaotic, while things are uncertain, while things are weird, let that kind of implode, let that kind of r reveal itself, but you're going to be so surprised what's going to happen. Spirit, talk to me about the justice card here. Yeah, 8 of cups reverse. This is something that they're wanting you to kind of they're moving something out. They're moving something out that should have been moved out a, a while ago. And this person, this thing has been just, I heard the word incoherent. Like they, they're taking a long time. It's not what spirit would have wanted, but they're taking a long time to kind of be dethroned, um, taken off of this pedestal. Some of you guys, it, it's like how people put someone on a pedestal. They'll be like, oh my God, this person is so amazing. This person is so this. It's like, who, who, who said that? Like, what, where are you guys getting this information from? Like, why, what makes this person so special? What makes this person so, um, so spirit is like trying to pull them off of the throne. This is long overdue. Give it time, though. It'll happen. Nine of Pentacles, Two of Swords. I just feel that something truly is going to... There's going to be a moment of deliberation. This is exactly what I'm talking about. A kind of an in-between. And then all of a sudden, things kind of fall together. Um, I want to revisit the word incoherent. Um, I feel like this person, whoever is in charge, whoever is the apple of your eye, whoever, whatever, it's... Um, it's kind of like they're kind of like being glorified right now. Um, spirit is just kind of questioning them. Right? They're going to have to go through their own growth process. They're kind of getting stripped. It's kind of giving me the tower vibes. They're going to, they're kind of getting stripped of their crown or stripped of their ego. They're going to be humbled in some way. This is going to be for their highest and greatest good. If this is a relationship and this is your partner or this is you within that relationship, that is not a bad thing. Um, in the meantime, though, you guys, be soft in this new beginning. Any new beginning has to, 
is like a, a seed and we don't rush we don't rush its growth especially with these uncertain circumstances especially with this chaotic energy um around whatever it is that you're going through right now this is a really interesting reading um be very soft with it and nurture it and support it support yourself that's really really a strong message that's coming through and it will it will continue to grow all right Taurus my loves I hope that this message resonates please let me know down in the comments I would love to know specifics about this oh my god freedom I'm not even surprised and what's this card family this is what I'm talking about this is gonna be a stronger family a stronger bond but something just needs to be freed something needs to be kind of stripped off of its throne right now and just humbled a little bit and then you get to come forward you get to step forward in a position of power but in the meantime work on developing those school skills for yourself it will happen all right Taurus my loves if you need any help when it comes to setting intention when it comes to working your magic please visit me in the apothecary bahadilife.com slash shop or just visit bahadilife.com I'll link it down below in the description box for you and put it in the comments for your fixed candles your intention oils your herbs all of the above everything that is that you would ever need in order to manifest your highest and greatest desires and to open doors of opportunity in your life okay until then i want to invite you to subscribe to the youtube channel because there's plenty more videos where this came from or turn on your notifications until then i'll see you guys in my next video bye created to live a life of magic abundance love and blessing all of which will be up to you to call into your life with perfect divine timing the Hottie Life Apothecary is the magical home of Jessica Alexandria, where you will find a wide variety of mystical items to help you to manifest your heart's truest desires, as well as tools to help you tap into your unlimited spiritual potential. Browse the online apothecary and find hand-fixed candles to magnetize your intentions towards you. You'll find time and star-soaked conjure oils charged to anoint your petitions, your body, and personal magical items. You'll also find the highest quality of herbs for creating your own potions and concoctions, and even reserve time and space with Jessica Alexandria herself, who will work with you to create something special and truly yours. Each item found within the apothecary are created with intention in alignment with the movement of the stars to make them even more powerful totems to bring into your own sacred space. Visit BahadiLife.com to browse the apothecary and don't forget to follow Jessica on Instagram at BahadiLife where she posts daily messages to uplift, inspire, empower, and to remind you of your magical potential along your magical journey. Blessings to each and every one of you. I'll see you there.